All right, hello, VOD gang. It is time for me to sip on some caffeine for just a second. Hold on. Mm. It's Christmas. It is Christmas, phone. It is goddamn Christmas. And I'll tell you why. Because, well, you may have already seen it. Like, it may have just been hiding there in the background. But there is... We've had a little bit of shenanigans with this run. I will admit. But mainly, it's to keep spirits high. And by keep spirits high, I mean mine, specifically. Yeah. Yeah, shenanigans, S fans. Hey, um, I may need you for one more uh, trade, and I think you know which one. But there is a certain clause that we've said from the beginning that was going to be enforced, but it never really showed up until last night. And at first... There was an incident with it that I was like, okay, this is a double fault, basically. Because I'll show you. I caught myself a shiny Citadel. And why do I say that that is shenanigans in particular? Because that, that goes against the No More Heroes clause of trying to not have a Pokemon from the previous run in the party. And I was like, you know what? I don't think we should do that. Like, I like um, this shiny. I'm eventually going to trade it um, into my games and store it in Pokemon Home and all that. But then the game was like, I got you. You can't use that one. Because that's ones that you already used. But... What if, what if, we gave you another one? And, uh, here we are. We are, uh, we're here with, uh, two Ubers. This, uh, this fella started as a Dratini. And I have no resources at my disposal to, um, to do anything shenanigan-wise or anything like that. This is not a trade from my Scarlet game. I only have the one Nintendo Switch in the household. And in fact, let me show you. Original trainer ID, 191410. 191410. Remember, this is from, uh, this is from S-Fan. This is S-Fan. <clears throat> so, needless to say, I feel a little bit better about certain things right now. And I think it is time, like, uh, like the tweet that went out said, Ah, oh, come on, man. You gotta have, you gotta have faith. You gotta have faith. This is the final challenge. Like I was just about to say, this is the final challenge. We have a... Yes, we have a track record. We have a track record of uh, killing Ubers. But you know what? We're, uh... We're gonna make the best of it. And we got two Ubers on the team, so if even, so if, you know, one of them dies, you know, there's, there's always the other one. I'm not trying to really say that. Oh, yeah. That bitch. I hate her. <laughs> I hate her so much. But we're ready for her ass this time. She, uh, she's going down. 
and at, like at, and as the um as the overhyped um video game um or movie trailer says it's it all ends tonight Ah, oh, Igly Buffs are just getting, like, fucking swatted away by the wind here. Pokemon League building looks so cool. Oh, yeah, what if we don't fucking do the uh, test ride again? That'd be funny as shit. Yeah, I failed. Uh, I did fail the test. Before we even got in here on the last run. But that was a non-Nuzlocke run. Hardest victory road ever? That's weird. Hold on. Just the fact that you can fail it at all is just weird to me. I thought it was going to be a little thing to where, like, they could be all like, well, I mean, you did get all the badges, so, I mean, fuck it. Go ahead on in. Like, maybe not in those exact words, but, you know, something like that. Here we go. Written in that old Sims language. Mm. You know what the ultimate twist of irony would be? Pokemon hires voice actors, but you start playing the game and you realize that they all speak like in Sims language. That would be the most ironic shit ever. They'd be all like, what? You said you wanted voice acting. You didn't say um, how that voice acting had to be. So we chose to make it in a fictitious language and then we just subbed it for you. Like, can you see them do some weird shit like that? Because they always do, like, this really weird backward shit. Like, they'd be all like, oh, well, you could do that, but... And then, like, you're like, oh, that's annoying. <laughs> you know, the bad part about that is I've... Mm, I feel bad now because, um... I put that idea into the world. And... It's probably just going to be something that happens. Okay, time to take a test. One of my favorite things of all time. Thank you for coming today. Please do take a seat. Alright then, androgynous character. I'll play your fucking game. Let's see. First portion. Okay. Okay. Have all eight. Think carefully. Let's begin. How'd you get here today? I rode on my Pokemon. All right. We'll see how it goes, man. Tell me the name of the school that you're enrobed in. Uva. Came to become a champion. Yep. I want to become stronger. Which of the eight gems gave you the most difficulty? Okay. Um. Glissado. Grusha. Uh, she used ice type. That's right. Don't even. Don't fucking play with me, bitch. Wait. What was the. F the fire croc? That's dumb. 
Like, okay, hold on. Actually, that may not be as dumb a question as I thought, because there are people, um, and I wish I was one of these people that had, like, two uh, Nintendo Switches, and they could just trade themselves, basically, the starters, like, back and forth and keep on starting new games. I wish I was one of those people. And I guess in that case, you could forget which of the three you picked and didn't trade yourself? Let's see, I'm going to repeat a previous question. Tell me, why do you become... I want to become even stronger. Don't fucking play with me, bitch. I'm here to win. It's time to fight. It's time to fucking fight. The final question is... Do you like Pokemon? Yes. That's so fucking dumb. Why you gotta scare me like that? Good job, kiddo. That about wraps up the interview. We were the first to congratulate you. Just passed the first part of the champion assessment. On your first try, him too. Yeah, I definitely have never failed this before, ever. Ever. Never failed it in my life. Okay. Um, are we allowed to go? Okay, we're not allowed to go back. We're straight up not allowed to go back. Uh-oh. Hold on. I just remembered something. Um, viewers, is one of you a regular? Because I need assistance from someone. Anyone at all. Anyone at all that is willing to do a trade and trade back. Because, uh... That would be very helpful. Because I just remembered, uh... We have, um... We have Zack here. And he's not evolved yet. And he would be a welcome addition to the team, you know? And I don't want to necessarily just go in there without him. Plus, um... Apparently, I actually need to go find, um, his item. So, I'll go ahead and do that real quick. s man, I hope you ain't eating a whole lot. Or that you can bring your Nintendo Switch where you, wherever it is that you're gonna eat. Swear to God. Somebody help me. I'm trapped. I'm trapped. Let's see. Uh, that's right. This place has the battle items. It's just a matter if you have the one that I'm looking for. And you don't. Fuck. Okay. Um, we can pull up uh, the item listing and uh, see where it is real quick. Ain't gonna take but a second. Let's see. Ooh. Pop my back a couple of times. Is it metal coat? Okay. Lavincia. Okay. Or Porto Miranata. Yeah, we could probably take a look over by the port just to see if we can pick one up if that's what they're saying you can do. Um, Porto Marinata. Okay, gotta take a look here. Okay. Oh, it's at an auction. Okay, no, we're not gonna do an auction just to get a uh, Melcoat. In fact, it's not even guaranteed that it would be there. 
so Levincia is where we're going to get it from. Which one is Levincia again? Because I do not know the towns. Even though I've played this game twice. Oh, okay. Alright. Actually, there's, um... There's a trio of uh, nuggets that you can get from this as well. I guess right now we're just kind of doing a little ti teeny tiny bit of prep work. Because, um, I mean, we technically can't go in yet where our team is not ready. And unfortunately, our team being ready is now tied to um, getting a trade in. I thought that we were, uh, I thought that it was just like, oh man, it's time to fucking go. But then it's like, no, it's not. But we can, uh, we can get a couple of cool little items. Luxury ball, my favorite Pokeball. For, um, the, uh, concept of that one, um, Valhalla lock kind of run, um, I've been, uh, working on, uh, catching all the Pokemon that I would use for it in, uh, Luxury Balls. So, uh, that's gonna be fucking awesome. Ooh. God dang it. Okay. How are we gonna do this? How are we actually gonna get up there? Ask the question. Can we actually get up onto these lights? I think I tried one time. Yeah, for some reason it won't let us do it. Can I get up onto the base of it though? No. I'm I'm struggling to remember how I actually did this. Cause you can't just you can't just climb on the side of the building, right? No, you can't. And that's too far. Did we literally like just get lucky or something? Fuck. God dang it. I'm gonna figure this out. S fan's gonna get back and he's gonna be like. I thought you said you were going to fucking take on the gym leader. I'm like, well, that'd be very nice if all of our Pokemon were evolved. And they'll be like, what are you talking about? Uh, uh. Yeah, I should have uh, actually uh, contacted him uh, earlier today because I have him on Discord. And I probably could have uh, just got the trade out of the way. But here's the thing about your favorite content creators is that they are not also business professionals. Ooh, Iron Head. That was actually worth coming up here for. Wee bonk. Um, I think there's actually... I think there's a TM on uh, one of these buildings. Yeah, but we gotta be careful to negotiate our way around. Okay, I see how we do it. And we go here, and then we're able to... Okay. Alright, what's well, this one? Psychic Fangs. That's... That's one that I completely forgot about. We. Alright, the trio. Nugget, nugget, and nugget. Hell yeah. And another TM? That's right. Encore. Okay. Much less valuable. Might as well get those things. Okay, now to get to the store that actually sells the uh, metal coat. So that whenever um, S-Fan or if somebody else uh, shows up that I know, like Zack or somebody, or even uh, Dottie, um, we can just do the trade.
Because, I mean, like, the thing is, is that, like, trading, like, a Scyther with a Metal Coat or, like, a Haunter or a Machoke or a Kadabra, that's, like, that's, like, a thing of trust, man. That really is. That, that like, lets you know who your friends are. Because they could just, they just be dicks and be all like, no, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> Then you're like, well, fuck, man. Let's see. What zoom lens? Oh, okay, I gotcha. Yeah, I can get some, uh, I can quickly get some more, um, money real quick just by selling those three nuggets that we got. Let's do it. I want to sell three chicky nuggies. Please give me your, all of your money for these three golden fried chicky nuggies. Thank you. Goodbye. All right. Thank you. All right, now let's get that one last item. Okay, battle items. There we go. Now we got all the lenses. All right, let's make sure to put um, the item onto... Um, Onto uh, good old Zachary Zoom so he can evolve whenever uh, we get a good trading partner. Or a trustworthy trading partner, I should say. There we go. And let's see. Hmm. Might as well just look through the TMs that we got real quick. See if uh, we're rocking with the best stuff that we can. Do we have anybody that can use a Grass-type move? I seriously doubt it. Let's see, though. There's also one other uh, thing I want to see. Okay. Okay. So I think I know what we can do um, in the very first room. I think we're going to send out um, Vengeance as our first one. And I think we're going to give him a different item, possibly. I think that we give him... I think we give him an item that will allow him to be more accurate with his Icicle Crash. And that's going to be... Let's see, I think it's the Wide Lens. Mm, yeah, because that's after the opponent. That's not um, a guarantee that we can uh, use that every time. But just a flat increase, I think, is what the Wide Lens is. Yeah, let's give that to... Yeah... And then we'll give, yeah, we may um, switch uh, between who uses what. But uh, as of right now, I think that's uh, probably our best bet. Alright, 
What can we do while we wait? Because we've already done all of our fucking grinding. Let's see. Actually, what uh, what kind of outbreaks are going on right now? Kind of curious about that. I uh, got little electro bird. Dude, I would love it if they were like, "Ooh, there's a manky outbreak." That'd be all like, a chance to break the fucking rules, a chance to break them. Oh man, it doesn't look like anything uh, super interesting, at least for. Uh, hordes or anything like that. I could probably go, um, let's see, I'm gonna save real quick, and, uh, I'm gonna switch the day over by one, and we're gonna see what we get. I know it's cheating, but we've done cheating on a, a whole bunch of stuff, so whatever. At this point, we're just we're just trying to have fun, and we're trying to bare minimum um, and like bare minimum um, acknowledge the rule of death. We need to uh, do one more day, one more day, because I didn't realize that the game was still actually playing. I thought I uh, thought I took care of that. No, that's not it. Let's see. Okay. Let's see. This fake ass date. There we go. And there we go. Yeah, I made myself a cool little icon. I was going to use uh, some other icons, but. I think I was too late because I was using a uh, free trial of a uh, Nintendo Switch Online, and I um, and I wasn't able. Uh, it was like you need a paid membership to do it, and I'm like, why does it fucking matter? I have the points, and you're gonna tell me that I can't use the points on profile picture items because I'm not paying a fucking um, subscription fee? That's bullshit. It's their system, like, I get it, but at the same time, Nintendo, like, you make some, you make some really weird systems. Like this fucking map. Jesus Christ. Okay. We're gonna keep on trying. Um, we... Like I said, we got nothing uh, that we can technically do until our team is ready. So we're just gonna we're just gonna see if we can bust the fucking game and uh, get something interesting that's a shiny because shiny claws. I wonder if we could luck up into a outbreak and a potential shiny for something that's already died. Oh, hold up. Okay. Actually have the game off this time. Fully off. Okay. 14th. Go. Hmm. Let's go. What do we got here? What's going to be the Pokemon outbreaks this time? I wonder if there is a actual schedule that we could look at and we could actually, like, basically choose what outbreaks we see. Like, something tells me that it exists because, like, we fast-forwarded two days, and I don't think we saved. And now this is what's up. So we got Golduck. We got... Ooh, we got Electro Bird right there. We got Buizel. And we got a uh, little 
piranha thing. Yeah, let's uh, let's keep on going. Let's see like what all there is like to be offered. Have something a little bit different. If we um, if we catch something live, that's a shiny, we're using it. Like there's a couple that um, that I would be interested in, but it's just a matter of us landing on them, pretty much, or landing on like their day, I guess you could say. But to be honest, I think I've tried to hunt um, shinies via outbreaks before, and um, all three shinies that I've encountered between games, I got because I wasn't even looking at all. I just saw them. Out and about. There is there. Um, and I think that's, uh, that's kind of interesting. I think the odds are, uh, I honestly think that the odds are better. And I'll tell you why. Um, it may be a one out of so many chance odds, but tell me. Don't you feel that you saw so many more Pokemon just during your regular ass running around? I mean, you could see 4,000-ish um, Pokemon in the course of a day if you just, like, kept running around long enough. Just a, just a little thing to think about. Ah, you're back, S-Fan. Um, we messed up a tiny, tiny bit. We need, uh, we require your assistance. <laughs> because, um, I got in there, and I realized that our team is not done. Because of that. You mind, uh, you mind helping a brother out real quick? <laughs> All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's, uh, that's what it is. You know how it is, man. And plus, having, uh, something that has a shit ton of resistances... I can't pass up on that. We have, um... We may have, um, Ubers, but, um... But fucking, um, Scizor is a wall that hits extremely hard. Just let me know when you get the ability to, and we'll, uh, and we'll do that real quick. And then right after, we're going in. We were seeing if we could, uh, get, uh, certain, um, outbreaks to happen. Because I was like, well, while we're waiting, let's see if we can, uh get an outbreak going and maybe um, force the game to give us another shiny. <laughs> and I was like, if we get a shiny of something that's died, we use it. <laughs> but nah, 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 nah. We're not gonna, we're not gonna um, waste our, any more time. Okay. I'll uh, go ahead and connect to you, my bud. I definitely appreciate this. I may have to uh, get together with you um, just to uh, trade some stuff around, basically, to trade stuff to you so I can restart um, either Scarlet or Violet and then basically get that stuff back. Like, it'd be a lengthy process, but hey, we don't have access to uh, Pokemon Home yet, so what other way really is there? Let's see. Whoops. Come on. Here. Ah, oh, you fucking... Really? You're gonna do that to me? Fucking game? <sighs> Thank you. I know about all that shit. Okay. Got to do that quick. Hmm. Here we go. All right, our final piece of the puzzle. 
If you got anything in particular you want to trade for evolution purposes, go ahead. It's fine by me, man. Okay. Oh, you just want to... It just had to be a burb now, didn't it? Just had to be a burb. Oh, the games we play. Oh, the games we play. Well, I mean, technically, hold on. If you think about it, I've got two burbs on the team. I've got Dragonite, who's a burb, and I got um, Kilowattrel, that's a burb. So, yeah. You think about that. I forgot that um, that uh, Zack is in a uh, luxury ball. That's gonna be badass. Having a fucking scissor in a luxury ball. My favorite god dang Pokeball of all time. And I can't help it, man. Like, I liked it before. Um, it blew up uh, in this game. Alright. Trading back. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> um, funny story. Um, way back in the day, um, Scizor, I think, was one of my first two level 100 Pokemon. And it was because a friend of mine back in elementary school... Um, we talked about um, doing trading and stuff, and he was just talking about doing all this crazy shit. Like, I'm going to give you, like, a level 100 Scizor and, like, a level 100 Mewtwo. And I didn't think too much about it. I was just happy to t have someone to talk to about it. And then all of a sudden, the day of the field trip comes, and he legit trades me a level 100 Scizor for nothing. Same thing with the Mewtwo. For nothing. And, like... It's, it's moments like those that really make you fans of certain games, you know? Like, it's just stuff that you can call back to, you know? I appreciate it, though, S-Fan. Yeah, dude dude was a fucking bro. I wish I was still friends with him, honestly. Because that, that was the coolest thing ever. In fact, I think I did... <laughs> I think I did a run of like so. Um, I think I did a run of silver, original silver, with me, that Mewtwo just going through there, and I was just like the challenge is trying to get him to fucking listen to me. <laughs> Maybe not in those exact words, but yeah, I mean eventually he would. But um, and uh, cool thing, cool uh, story about that Mewtwo as well is what I did was I put on that Mewtwo uh, Thunder Punch, um, Ice Punch, and... Um, it's Christmas! Yeah, Thunder Punch, um, Ice Punch, and Fire Punch. And then I put Psychic on him. Because I was a little Applehead kid. I didn't know any better. I, um, I didn't um, think to, um, you know, put Thunderbolt or Flamethrower or ice beam on them um and then i uh realized that like oh man mewtwo's can have recover but mine doesn't have recover anymore and back in the day you couldn't remember moves and there was only one way at all that you could have a pokemon remember moves and that was to play pokemon stadium 2 and you would have to beat the um, Elite Four and the Champion, and you would have the option to have a Pokemon of your choice remember a move. And I did that so that Mewtwo could relearn Recover. It was, uh, it was, it was different times, man. And now, um, and now I'm pretty sure we're at the point where we don't need even an actual physical character uh, present to remember um, the moves 
Um, in addition to that, I'm like 90% sure that was for, uh, oh yeah, yeah, that was it. That was another thing. Yeah, that was before the um, actual stat split uh, occurred. And not only that, but category, um, like, yeah, like the actual uh, making of like, these are physical type moves. These are special type moves. And it wasn't just like, all fire is this, all ice is that. Um, so, like I said, I was a little apple-headed kid back then. I was just like, this looks cool. I want Mewtwo to punch things. And don't get me wrong, it worked. Mewtwo punching anything at level 100 is probably going to kill it, especially in um, the regular-ass uh, Pokemon Stadium 2 before the... Um, before the actual Master Challenge version. Um, but yeah, it was, it was a wild time. But now, like I was saying, like we not only don't need an NPC or anything like that to remember moves, but I'm pretty sure that our Pokemon also remember um, moves that were taught by TMs now. So hypothetically, you could teach every TM that a Pokemon can learn... And you literally just have their, like, entire-ass move pool. Forever. I would have to, uh, double-check on the accuracy of that, though. Yeah, they probably were all special, now that I think about it. Like, fire, um, ice, and electric probably would all be, um, special. Yeah, that's why I fucking, like, Mon's, like... For alligator were so fucking terrible in the beginning and then whenever um diamond and pearl happen you didn't need uh oh yeah shit my bad we were talking about the fucking uh move deleter and the move remember and all that shit and i didn't even yeah thank you for that thank you <laughs> Okay. Yeah, we need to have him learn Bullet Punch because he is a technician, which means that this is going to hit pretty fucking hard. And I'm pretty sure... Okay. We need to take a look at uh, the ability technician before we go in. Um, Let's see. Where's the Paldean Pokedex? Or wait... Paldea Pokemon, that's that's fine. Whoops. Control F, bitch. Okay. Scizor. Technician. Okay, base power 60 or lower. I just need to make sure that everything qualifies for that. Um, I'm probably going to um, keep Fury Cutter in there because Fury Cutter will um, will get more powerful, probably to a ridiculous level. And I think um, we're going to put... Um, yeah, I think, I think we just put on... Um, bullet punch and if we need to outspeed anything we just do that and we try to hit him as hard as we possibly can um what move oh actually i just had a really i just had a really evil idea um hold on because i think like by by vir by virtue of its name i want to see if um something is correct here okay ability decks there we go okay yep all right so here's what we're gonna do we're gonna make we're going to make Bullet Punch ridiculous, is what we're going to do. Because we're going to give Scizor Punching Glove. And we're going to watch the madness unfold. Uh, 
Um, okay. Let's see. I think we give um, our birdie scope lens. And I think that's where we, uh, I think that's where we go from here. And we're gonna go ahead and rest here before we actually go inside. Because we need to make sure all of their um, power points are good and ready. So here's here's the ruling, S-Fan. Um, I think I kind of went over it before. Um, we either win this or we're done. That is as simple as it does. If we lose, nobody's... If we lose, nobody's dying this time. The, the run just ends. Because we've had way more than enough blood on our hands. If we can't win with this team, there isn't another one coming that's going to be able to do this anyway. So, this is it. This is all we've got. I mean, it's a good all we've got. But we don't have... We don't have enough encounters. We don't have enough good mons to make a like a third string team. We don't. So this is it. We're doing it right now. Yep, we're ready. Got to get my testosterone pills in me. Man, fucking... Hey, we've got two burbs in here. Three if you count Scizor, because Scizor's got wings. Red Scizor gives you wings. I just thought of the most fucked up scenario that you could probably imagine. Okay. Um, here's the thing. I think that there needs to be, let's see, I think that there needs to be a physical graphic indication of a Pokemon's shininess. I think they need to bring back the bling thing in the overworld, and I'll tell you why. Because of one very important thing. Pokemon like Scyther. And what I mean by that is Pokemon like Scyther that have a shiny that is very, 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 like, hardly noticeable. But when it evolves, it's a completely different story. Like, Shiny Scizor is essentially Scyther colored. Same thing with um, Cleavor. So, I think they need to, like, I think somebody needs to bring that shit up and be like, you need to bring it back, man. Because, um, who knows how many people have actually walked by Pokemon like that to where they're so subtle at first as a shiny, but like as they evolve, they get much more interesting looking. Like, don't get me wrong, um, there probably there's not a whole lot of uh, examples, but they exist, and Scyther just so happens to be one that is from this generation. So the problem already exists. Like with the uh, Dratini, I didn't, like, I didn't get a little fucking bling or anything like that. I saw it out the corner of my eye. Same thing as um, the uh, Citadel that I saw. Just out the corner of my eye, because the toddle is, like, you could kind of tell, but it's kind of subtle. And you may think to yourself, oh, maybe the lighting engine is just hitting that one weird or something like that. 
Like, you know what I mean? Like, but, um, here's the thing, though. I think that if you're, if you're in the market to hunt shinies, you're not gonna, like, make those mistakes. But, um, thing is, though, is if you're just looking around casually, you are, you're probably gonna miss them. Okay. Yeah, we passed it. Now we can fucking die. You ready, S fan? We're about to We're about to see this through one way or the other. Like I said, either we win here or the run ends. Cool. I didn't need server communication to do this anyway. Let's just do this. Apparently, you can only fight the Elite Four once. Like, it's written up on uh, Cerebi that that's a thing. Like, has anybody tried to fight them again? I wonder... Like, must have, uh, someone must have tried to fight them again at one point, and then, like, or at multiple points, and the game's just like, no, 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 you don't fight the Elite Four ever again. Like, all of them are, um, possible opponents, or is it just random ones? Because I know that the Dragon Trainer can technically show up because he is a teacher, so that makes sense. All right, Vengeance. All right. Let's set up. You were me and S-Fan's chosen son. <laughs> Oh shit, Sinhalese. Yeah, we're finishing this fucking run. Oh, it's on, bitch. It's fucking on. Key up. Oh, held on. Held on by just a touch. Okay, we get a healing item for every, um... All right, we're gonna just do the guaranteed. All right, there we go. Whisk cash is done. Yeah. Camera upped. Um, what is? Okay, we have to figure out the relation uh, between. Let's see. Okay. Going back a little bit. Okay. It's okay to have um, all the fucking shit pulled up. Okay, so camera upped. Um, ooh, there's something bad here. Yeah, there's something real bad. But I don't know if we, uh, if we just try to beat his ass or not. I don't know if we have the option to. We're gonna take a look. Um. Yeah, I don't think we have the option to, uh, just try to beat his ass. So... Let's see. All right, what can we do? Okay, he might use uh, Earth Power. Okay. Yeah, let's be a dick. All right, Vengeance. Time for Jade! Oh, you little fucker. Okay. Do we... 
do we hit him as hard as we can? I think that's probably the best option. We try to hit him as hard as we can. Yep, okay. We hit. We connect! Yes! That is what we need. We just need a straight up kill. The snow has stopped. Okay. And Jade's asleep now. Dawn fan, we have to stay in for one. Ooh. Okay, Pokemon. E hmm. Take a look here. I'm pretty sure I know the answer to this question. Okay, yeah. Yeah, this is probably going to be the best option for us. Because we have a fucking living wall. And you missed. And you fucking missed. Okay. Time to see how good this works. All right. Not quite as good as I wanted it to. Ooh. All right. We do a sword dance, and we can get an attack in. We'll probably heal after he does uh, his thing. Ooh. Fuck. Okay. Yeah, we heal now. Alright, this is the first um, item that we use. We got four more for this battle. Oof. Okay. Good, good, good. Alright, let's see what a sword dance bullet punch does. Okay, now we're talking. Now we're fucking talking. I think this is how we do the rest of the fight. Like, yeah, I think this is how we do the rest of the fight. Here we go. Claude Sire. Let's see. Nah, we're gonna keep it going. Trying to be patronizing and shit. Alright. Let's do it. I feel bad for Claude Sire. I don't want to knock him out. He's a he's a chubby little guy. And look at him, now he's got a big old hat on. He's got a big old hat. He's got the weight of the world on his head. Ooh. That just stinks of desperation. I'm sorry. Yeah, even a priority move can't get through that. So, hopefully it... Okay. Jesus. Uh-oh. Okay. So, terrestrialized Earthquake. But from a Claude Sire, though. Ooh. Okay. All right. We're good. We're good. We win this. Bullet punch. Done. All right. And that is how you fucking do it. Ah, uh, she's trying to play all coy. She knows she's all about this. You know what I'm, you know what I'm saying, dog? Hell yeah, that's right, player. Let's see. That's right. Let's see, but who knows? I'm beginning to think you might be one of the blah, blah, blah. All right. It's time for the Steel Trainer, in which we actually do 
have just a straight up answer for and it's gonna work for a little bit and then we're gonna have to um, switch some stuff around okay so we just yeah we just awaken you Uh, interesting thing is, um, her opener, Copperjaw, has play rough. Otherwise, I would have just said Dragonite and be done with it. But, um, it seems like Jericho's up to bat. <laughs> All right, let's do this. So this comes to a very interesting uh, point. In almost all of these, if Jericho is faster, that's pretty much how this is gonna go. Is Jericho faster than a copper job? Is Jericho faster than a Tinkaton or a Bronzong? I think Bronzong, it's pretty safe to say. There we go. And uh, Tinkaton is probably not. We're going to keep it going, though. We live or die by the decisions that we make right now. Um, this thing's ability is not sturdy. So we give this a shot. And our special attack continues to rise. All right. Um, we won't get the shit knocked out of us by this thing. But we uh, we may be inconvenienced by the fact that it can attack first. Oh God! Yeah, you're right. It's a burb. Oh, wait a minute, what? We're faster? We're just gonna melt all of her shit at this point. Because we've increased our special attack three stages. And, and same thing here is this Magnazone has nothing that can one-shot us, really. It has stuff that can inconvenience us, but nothing that'll kill us. The only thing that's going to inconvenience us is this. Okay, so we have to see if he's going to... Oh, shit. Okay. Hmm. Okay. This one's gonna be... This is gonna be interesting. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, yeah, yeah. It, it's inconvenient, but it's not gonna kill me. Your last Pokemon will tr turn this around? Okay. Um. Okay. So. <sighs> hmm. 
we go one time. I don't think we can outspeed her, but she has one move that can mess with us. But the thing is, is that we haven't been hit one time by anything. She has one attack, but I don't know if she will use it because she's gimmicking right now. Oh, she is. Oh, fuck. Victory. That has to be it. That has to be it. That's it. That's it. We're done. We're done. Whew. Okay, I'm going to say it real quick. Um, is it just me or did certain gym leaders feel tougher than these guys? Because, like, in my, um, in my regular ass run, I didn't think these guys were particularly challenging. All right, it's Larry's turn. Larry, the character that was almost made exclusively for the fans that have been here since the beginning. <laughs> like, I really feel that that's the situation. Okay, so... Yeah. Alright, here's the thing. We may... We may be able to pull what Chomp did in the last run because our ice type um, basically demolished the last two uh, members. There's a notable exception to this, but I've got a pretty good feeling. That's right. That's what I was looking for. Do we have a uh, up? Do we have one? Okay. Yeah, we'll use that on the icicle crash. Do we have to restore it now? Since we just used it? No, we don't. Okay. So I think um, we kind of set this up yeah, we actually should be fine, because um, the only thing that probably could have really messed with us is, yeah, her, um, his uh, Altaria. And if we um, uh, terastalize into pure ice, then we're good. The only um, thing that's going to be interesting is actually um, the hit rate of uh, Icicle Crash because it's not perfect. It's a 90. But speaking of somebody who has a Pokemon that's my favorite that has a 90 hit chance uh, move as its signature, it's not too bad. Oh god, don't you put that evil on me, man. All right, time to set up. <laughs> Ladies and gents, it's time to set up shop. It's time to make this place into an ice rink and our home for the duration. And actually, um, thing is, is that we'll probably be good through the rest of, like, we'll probably be good for the gym, or not the gym leader, but the last Elite Four member too. Aw, oh, you motherfucker, man. Really? You're gonna do that? Okay, dickhead. Nice uncle crash. Alright, we get a hit. <laughs> That's quad effective, so you're fucking dead. 
One burb down. Staraptor. We keep going. All right. This. Oh. Let's see. Yeah, we have to keep on uh, going, that's the thing. But, let's see. Alright, I think I know what to do. Burb on burb action, bitch! Because I know what he might do. I'm not, I'm not willing to let Vengeance succumb to it. Yep! There we go. Mm-hmm. You dumb fucking burb. I need to give you a nickname whenever we're out of here. Good. Good. Altaria. Uh, yeah, we gotta keep that going. Okay. I think I know what's gonna happen now, so I'm going to switch accordingly. I'm willing to bet. Yep. The snow stopped. Okay. This is gonna be... This is gonna be scary. Okay. Alright. We're good. I was worried because Altaria actually has Flamethrower. But this is quite effective. So... All right, and for the rest of this, we should be fine. Yeah. Keep it going. Damn, we outspeed pom-poms. All right. Flamigo. We can't switch out, but we will switch out whenever he sends uh, out Flamigo. Because I know what it'll do. I know exactly what it'll do. And uh, we're gonna exploit... We're gonna exploit him. Swap. Let's go. And not only that, but there's no good answer. For, um, for our Electro Burb. Alright. What you got, bitch? You won't use a flying move, though. I know you won't. Because you're going to do close combat. Okay. This is a... This is a questionable game, but we're going to stack the odds in our favor because we haven't used one damn healing item in this whole fight. There's not an option that he can do that will hit us. Uh-oh. Okay, so he's going to try to... He's going to try to get the most amount of damage possible. I mean, I get it. Ooh. I mean, we could fuck with them. Yep. This is the this is the game we're going to play because I know for a fact that this little fucker can outspeed his little fucker. I know it can. Without a shadow of a doubt. 
We do one more roost and we go. Because we want to be sure that this KOs. All right, halfway down, it is time. Go. End it, Barb. <laughs> That's fucking right. Burb's fucking awesome. Well, that took the wind out from under our wings. Yep, sure did. And then there was one. Let's see. Ah, oh, there we go. Why can't we have Hassel's hairstyle? I want that. It's Christmas! You know, not biased or anything like that, but... Okay. Time to heal up, make sure we got everything that we need. I'm gonna use the last regular ass potion for this little boy right here. And I'll give I'll give Jericho a fresh water. There you go, mister. Okay. Um, I'm gonna, um, do a real quick bathroom break, and we will get on with the fight with Hassel. This is, this is going pretty good, but the thing is, is that this is exactly how the last romp through the Elite Four went with me, because, like, we didn't faint any. We just kind of smacked him up. Like, don't get me wrong, I'm kind of happy that at least a team not only made it, but is getting it, getting its time in with the Elite Four. But, like, is, is this the worst Elite Four of the generations? I kind of have to think so. But, um, yeah, I'll be right back, guys. Just, just a sec. I'll think about it while I'm, uh... I'm doing my business.
All right, guys, we are back. I got myself an extra serve and a cafe because I'm feeling extra fucking spicy. Um, so, let's see. We need to do the names, or we need to do the honor of naming this soul who has actually been helping. Like, I'm really surprised at how good this guy actually is. And, you know what? There's only one name. Oh yeah, I didn't, but we're going to name him the name that he deserves. Don't call the police on me. Hold on, wait. Hold on. Whenever you see it, you won't want to report it to the Nuzlocke police, okay? He's not just a burb, he's the burb. He's the burb. He's, he's our special burb. This is such a ragtag group of fucking Pokemon, too. Like... There's only, there's only three of them that are actually from this generation. You wouldn't expect anything from him, but he's, he's, okay, hold on. Let me, have you, S-Fan, have you actually ever used one of these before? Like one of these? I'm willing to bet no. <laughs> take, take your time, take your time, take your time. Not yet? Okay. Let me show you why you should actually consider using them. And I, like, I will fully admit. Yeah. 185 speed. 174 special attack. His defenses aren't fucking terrible. This is a fucking burp. <laughs> It has access to Tailwind and Roost. And not only that, this Volt Absorb isn't even his best ability. We could make him better if we had an ability capsule, but we don't have the ability to buy an ability capsule. So... I can't show you how good he really is. But his other ability is actually... Hold on, I'm, I'm going to look this up real quick. I'm going to see if I can uh, actually give you an idea. Because, uh, I, like, I'll, I'll say the praises of this thing. This thing proved me wrong. It's a, it's a goofy-ass looking bird, but sometimes, man, sometimes the strangest ones are the best one. Okay. Its other ability is called wind power, and uh, when it's ch um, when it becomes charged, when it's hit by a wind move, it boosts the power of the next electric type move that it does. So basically, what it does. Let's see. Yeah, you can actually. Use Tailwind on yourself to activate the ability. Because here's the thing. Tailwind will... Um, I'm pretty sure... Let me make sure. Okay, it doesn't say exactly how much, but Tailwind just raises the speed of everything on your side for, like, um, four turns. So... He has a lot going for it, and, like, there's only one thing that I would say is going against him, and it's it's not the biggest deal, but at the same time, at the end of the day, like, you kind of have to acknowledge it. Yeah, it's the only thing that he has against him is that his move set is very shallow. He's going to do that one thing, and that is all he's going to do. Like, pretty much what you saw, the only, um, the only things that could really change is, like, do you want to set up for Rainy Day and use Thunder instead? Do you put on Thunderbolt instead? 
that's the only um, that's the only difference because uh, because offensively he doesn't have um, other options. The only way that you could give him another option is uh, oh, actually, interesting thing. He can learn weather ball through breeding. So if you forsook um, wind power and you made him into a rain dance user, put thunder on him and put weather ball on him, you would have a 100% accuracy um, electric move. And you would also have a weather ball that's water type for coverage against rock and ground. Well, rock, more specifically. But uh, you could also take on fire if you wanted to. But yeah, like, he's, he's neat. I'm, I'm flabbergasted that he is decent. Like, it almost makes me want to check out Flamigo now. Like, seriously, like, actually look at Flamigo's uh, moveset and see uh, what he's all about. I don't expect to find a whole lot, but you know, I've, I've obviously been wrong before. Yeah, Flamigo's about the same. Just has one thing that's gonna do. Oh, that's neat. It, um, Flamigo has, uh, two really good, uh, abilities. Like, you can uh, actually hit ghost types um, with uh, normal and fighting moves with uh, one of uh, Flamigo's abilities. Okay. So, normally, this would be scary. Normally. But remember, we're playing generation... We're, we're playing this generation of Pokemon. So we're about to make this really trivial. I don't know if I've shaken this up yet. Yeah! <laughs> Had to shake it up as he was doing it. Mm. You're a little asshole. <laughs> okay. Does he have anything that will outright kill us? Um, I don't think he does. So I think we try for Icicle Crash. Okay, good, 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 good. Not only that, but uh, we have a Snowstorm up, so our defense is upped. So we'll heal whenever he sends out his next Pokemon. Okay, Haxorus. Yeah, we're gonna keep it going. He doesn't have an answer to us. Not that I'm aware of. Okay. Alright, so first healing item of this. Just gonna make it a full restore, because our boy is, uh, is full of HP. Ooh! Hoo, 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 hoo. Ooh, I see you. I see you, and I raise you Icicle Crash, bitch, because I'm just a little bit faster. Yeah. Take that. I think that may have been the scariest thing that he can bring to, like, bring into our, like, faces. Nah, we're just gonna keep it going, man. I think this wide lens pretty much makes us 100% um, accurate, by the way. So that accuracy of 90 for Icicle Crash just doesn't affect us anymore. Wants to learn to move Overheat? No, we're not going to do that. Okay, Snow Stop. So we probably have to set back up. Yeah, we, uh, we'll set back up. Or actually, ooh, I just thought of something that may be a little bit concerning. Let's see, let's go back. Yeah, there we go. 
What does Flapple know is my question. Because I think... Okay, yeah, we're, we're good. We'll just set back up. All right, set up shop. This is our place. Leech seed. Ugh. It's aggravating, but he pretty much wasted his turn. Thing is, is that we're going to switch it up last turn, and that's how we're going to win this. Quad! There we go. Ooh. This might get scary, okay? Only a little more until you pass. Don't let up. Okay. Yep. But we do have a defense buff. Okay. Wait. Hmm. Okay, we can't use... Hmm. We may be in a little bit of a pickle. Just a little bit of one, though. Okay. Yeah, it's gonna tear up, but we're just gonna try... We're gonna try to out-hit it. <laughs> It gets the defense buff, too, so this is going to be a battle of wills. Oh, wait. Actually, there is one thing we can do. And I think it would pretty much just... Yeah. Okay. So we probably live whatever he's going to do. Oh, wait a minute. That's right. He's terrestrializing into a dragon type. So we may be good. Ooh. Oh. You ready for the retaliation? He's done, son. <laughs> All right. <laughs> the mighty dragon has fallen. That's right. Cry about it. Cry about it. Go cry to mama. Cry to mama. And we got one more. The most boring of all. Oh my god, I just realized something. We're about to embarrass the champion. Oh my god. It's not even gonna be fair. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be the best fucking thing ever like ever dude oh my god we are about to witness a massacre thank you for the heal oh jesus Okay. A massacre. Absolutely. It's gonna be at the hands of this man. You're gonna watch this and you're just gonna be like, what is happening right now? <laughs> like, this is payback for everything, dude. This is gonna be, like, 
This is gonna be the most amazing shit you've ever seen. Like, I guarantee you. Okay, let's see. I just need to see if I can complete um, the setup. I'm gonna see if I can get one more thing. And uh, if we can, then this is locked. If not, it's gonna be close to a lock. Or actually, hold on. Is it? Um. Wait. Okay. Let's see. Oh my god. It It's gonna be a lock. It's gonna be a fucking lock. Okay. Here we go. That's all we needed. That is all we needed to secure the victory. That's all. All we need is one turn for setup. And then we're done. Like, there is nothing that the champ can actually do. There isn't... Let's see. There isn't one Pokemon on her team that can do anything... I hope, I hope you're ready for it, because blink and you might miss it. Oh, she's utterly incapable of holding back in Pokemon battles. That definitely shows through to her character at the core. I'm going to enjoy this. Hey, Zach, guess what? Your Pokemon's about to sweep the champion. You came just in time. But this is you. You're not playing World of Warcraft. I was going to do it, but, like, I had way too much... Like, I had to put way too much time into prepping. Let's see. Here we go. Sorry. But your boy... Your boy... Is about to fucking annihilate the champion. It's you. Okay. Alright, reflect. That's fine. Oh, we, we're good. We, we're 100% fine. We actually just set up to where we're going to one-shot everything that she has. Avalog? Whatever. Bring it, bitch. Come on. Let's do it. What's that shit? Oh, man. Mm. I think I made... All right. I think I know what happened. Let's see. Oh, wait, yeah. Yes! We broke the reflect. Oh my god. I didn't even... I didn't even think about how that would be useful. Yeah, keep current Pokemon. Keep it going. Keep it going. Supreme Overlord. Oh, you gained stats from the Fallen? Well, guess what? That don't fucking matter when it's quad effective, bitch! <laughs> Valooza. Um, yeah, you know what? We're good. We're good. Key, yo! This is... This is great. Oh, from the Nimona fight? Oh, yeah. Go, Zach! Go! Ha 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 ha! Yes. Yeah.
Horus. Go, my son. Continue your dominance. <laughs> There's only one more Pokemon left. I don't know, man. I don't think so. Because Scizor, despite being a Steel type, is pretty quick. We'll see. But but uh, the thing is, is that it doesn't have anything that's super effective against me. Ooh. Ah! Okay. You know what? You know what, Zach? You know what, Zach? You did. You did say it. But now it's time for S Fan to take the stage. S Fan! Finish it! S Fan survived. Zachary made a uh, made a sacrifice to sweep ninety percent of her team. <laughs> no, you made the sacrifice. It was you. <laughs> it was all you. But we honored your sacrifice, Zach. Congratulations, it's amazing! Alright. There's only one more damn thing. This bitch. This bitch right here. Yep, you're dead. Yeah, we just fucking did it. This is what it's been building towards. Zachary Zoom putting out the, uh, putting out the actual, uh, like, being like, I did not endorse this. That is fine that you didn't endorse it, because it's going away anyway. But, uh, but, uh, do we have anything that we could use? We do have something that we could use, but... I don't know. I feel like... Okay. So basically, the way that it works now... Is this is our team for the rival fight? Because I'm not gonna... Um, well, I might be able to... Hmm. Yeah, we'll put Chungus in. We'll level, uh, we'll get Chungus as far up as we possibly can. And we need to, uh, take a look at... Yeah. Well, S fan, I don't mean to be that guy. I really don't. But it's not the first time. <laughs> Let's learn to move heavy slam. Yeah, let's do that. 
Um, yeah. <laughs> We've been through so much, haven't we, buddy? We watched our we watched our children go off to die. <laughs> but we did it together. And at the end of the day, isn't that what um isn't that what family's all about? And in the end of the day, it's just like Vin Diesel says, nothing's stronger than family except for a more powerful Pokemon. That's right. Okay. Okay. So this is how it goes. We're going in. And what happens, happens. I almost kind of want to try to level Chungus. Because Chungus could actually do something. Yeah... You know what? We could level Chungus real quick before the final battle. I mean, it's one Pokemon as opposed to a whole fucking crew. And for the Elite Four and the Champion to only lose one Pokemon? I mean, it's not bad. Blood has to be spilled. That's the only way it's interesting. Uh, where do we go? Uh-oh. She's in the fucking town square, though. Like, if I go near the town square, does she automatically trigger the battle? If so, I need to go to another area to get what I want to get. Actually... We defeated the champion, so do we get general goods? Nah. Okay. Where is... Oh, um, another, um, Chansey Mart, because I know that there's one in the town center, but I don't know if you, like, approach the town center right now, if she automatically triggers the fight. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking here, too. Is that a, uh, yeah, there we go. Let me see it. Cool. We'll just go there. Because, shit, I probably should have looked at um, Chungus before I even went because I may have already given him a mint just to make him a uh, adamant nature. Yeah, but like if we go into the town square, I don't know if uh, she's like, oh, you want to fight, right? And be like, no, I just wanted to go shop. You want to fight, right? And it's like, oh, God, yeah, sure. I want to fight. <laughs> Like, I don't want to get into that situation if I can, uh, if I can help it. Here we go. Also, see if they got something else in here. Because, uh, we did beat the champion. I'd like to buy. HP up. Okay, they don't have it. But, they got this. All right. S Fan, you want to do um, a raid or two so I can uh, so I can get some uh, candies for Chungus before we do the final fight. Let's see. Are you like no? This is your fight. You must finish it. Might get an assault vest for um, for Chungus. Now that I think about it, because uh, that would make his um, that would make his um, defense stats stupid. <laughs> but I don't know. Let's see. Ah. Oh. 
we can probably actually go back to Mesagoza. Okay. Yeah, I'll um I'll join one here in a second. West Cash Dark Four Star. Yeah, I can do that. I guess if um do you think we need to actually be in a uh, lobby together or do you think that I can join just off of your code? Go ahead and make sure I'm in online mode. That would probably help. Okay. That's fine. Let me just run. Run! Okay. Hold on just a second. I'm just gonna buy the thing. Buying the thing. Buying the thing. Find the thing. Thing's not here. Okay, never mind. All right, gonna go into the menu. Going to Poke Portal. Going into Terra Raid Battle. And going into Link Code. Okay. A H T N. K H there we go. All right. Yeah. It's a ghost type. Still, I could do that. Yeah, that's good enough. Key oh. <laughs> oh, help has arrived. Oh, well help arrived but it also happens that we have iron valiant as a pokemon so i mean that's all the help we really need <laughs> yeah we're just gonna smack him upside the head and that's gonna be it you had a grouchy cat those are the best that just means that they have lots of personality All right, I'm going to burn it, and then I'm going to use Hex. Oh. Poor. Poor Kibby. Why won't it work? You bitch. No. Oh. Well, she was doing her business. You can't be messing with a kitty whenever they're doing their business. They're all like, oh, I'm doing my business. Oh, I gotcha. What just happened? Oh, okay. There we go. The grouchy babies are always the best babies. Because that's when... But that's when you love them the most. <laughs>
All right, here we go. Back at it. Let's see. Shadow Ball. Oh, Jesus. All right. It's going to be right down to the fucking wire. All right. Cool, cool, cool. We defeated the Wish Cash. That is a ghost type for some reason. Get out of here, Wish Cash. Don't come back. Right. All right. Appreciate that, S fan. I'm gonna see if I can. Uh... <sighs> we haven't faced her yet. <laughs> Let's see. There we go. We didn't face Nimona. <laughs> and Nimona's got some fucking hands coming her way. Alright, Isfan, if you want another raid. Jesus. No, I don't want to watch... I don't want to watch NCIS with you or Greg's Anatomy. I want, I want to do my thing. I don't want to... I don't want to be like an old couple... Watching Greg's Anatomy. I want to, I want to do my thing. <laughs> All right. I'm gonna see if I can figure. I was I was trying to do a thing where like you were um that we were in a. Uh, that we were in a uh, relationship and you were the uh, older girlfriend and you were like, let's watch Greg's Anatomy together. Come on. And I'm like, no, I want to, I want to, I want to do my thing. And you're like, no, it's time for Greg's Anatomy. <laughs> no. <laughs> All right. If I can't get this one, I'll, uh, I'll join yours. Uh, S fan. Cause I'm sure I'll get some, uh, I'll get a good bit of mediums, which will still, uh, which will still get us a couple levels. And plus, it's only 640 right now. <laughs> get some from Michael Jordan. Get some help from Michael Jordan. <laughs> you want some... Wait, you want me to, you want to try to get me, um, man, man, I'll be, um, I'll be Michael Jordan sugar baby, I guess, man. Shoot. All I'm saying is financial security is financial security, my dude. You can do that sus face all you want, but good God, like, if somebody was like, hey, 
Um, like if you were like if all of a sudden Bill Gates comes up to you, he's like, "Hey, I'm Bill Gates. Um, if you uh, if you promise to be my ass slave, you'll never um, have to uh, worry about another thing in your life." You'd think about it at least for a hot minute, okay? Don't even, don't even think about it. Like, like, don't even, don't come at me with that kind of sus thing when you, when you're like, hmm, Bill Gates taking care of everything I would ever need. <laughs> See, these are the, these are the things that, uh, you come to the stream for, the questions that make you ponder life. <laughs> And plus, Zach, if I get on World of Warcraft, it's just going to be continuing to level um, my uh, warrior orc. That's all I'm going to do. <laughs> like... I mean, if you're if you're down for that, then it's fine. I'm not saying you didn't help or anything like that. I'm just saying, like, if... Uh... <laughs> Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Well, I wouldn't mind, um... Oh, my God! We murdered it! Yeah. Um, yeah, if you're down to, um, doing, um, doing just regular-ass leveling, then I'm fine. In fact, um, you know what? Um... I'm going to take the candies that we got from this one. By the way, thanks, uh, S-Fan, for those uh, two raids. I'm just going to take the candies that we got right now. I'm going to level up Chungus to whatever we can get him to, and we're going um, to finish this tonight. We're going to do this because um, I, uh, I wouldn't mind doing uh, World of Warcraft. Uh, S-Fan, um, do you just have just the tower, or do you have um, anything, like, do you have a uh, laptop that's able to do WoW or anything? I didn't know if you might want to join, or, because, like, honestly, with with my old age, <laughs> it's kind of kind of hard to keep up with uh, what everybody has. Actually, I think, um, I'm going to be honest, I think I know what it is about my memory is uh, particularly the fact that my regular ass uh, day job requires me to remember so much stuff it's hard for me to pick up new things and store them in my mind because um i work at a place um i'm not gonna go into too much detail i just work in a place to where um basically um, very important information has to go to the right place and there is a chance um, that it could go to the wrong place and uh, cost the company like a lot of money. Okay. Um, is it able to do um, WoW as fan? Because like we could all three uh, go in and do some stuff. Like I'm not opposed to the idea. It's just like I'm not going to be able to do, um, Dragonflight content. I'm just... Okay, then, yeah, we'll, we can do World of Warcraft, yeah. Let's just get this fight. That's right, Zach, yeah. 2060 mobile, that's pretty good. Uh... On Alliance. All right. Okay, the stage is set, guys. Final battle. And here's the thing. We've made it this far. If we lose, the run is over. If we win, the run is over. So there's no point in throwing anything out. So everyone make an alliance character? Um, I guess I could do that. But I'm going to really have to think about um, what um, character I want to do. The greatest battle of all time. I mean, she's up there. She really is up there. Uh, 
Um, we might as well get the extra stab. <laughs> And it seems like we could actually go a little bit, assuming that he can stand up to hits like this. Is it the uh, same uh, server that I've been playing on, uh, Zach? Or is it a uh, different server? Oh, wow. Okay. Go, Chungus. You're under level to shit. You're definitely not going away. Like, I'm glad I'm sticking to this. Win or lose, the team will stay. Ooh. Yeah. Same question um, for me, for you, uh, S-Fan. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, 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 can't do that. Can't do that. Gotta wait until he comes out. Okay. Oh, this actually works better. Okay. Yeah. Use it. Use it, you dumb little shit. Use it. Yes. Oh, God. Okay, thank you. Woo! That's it. Okay. Ooh, okay. All right. We're doing good. Oh, how did you avoid that? Uh-oh. Oh, shit. Okay. One more. One more. Ah! Fuck! Alright. Burb, you did good. You did good, man. Alright. Okay, what do we do about... What do we do about Paw Mutt? No. I mean, yeah. Yeah. All right, S fan. It's time for you. We're just gonna we're just gonna fight as hard as we fucking can. Oh. Starting to... Yeah. But the good news is, is that this is the end of the run, so you're not dying. You will live on. Oh, shit. There we go. Orthworm. Yeah, we keep going. Um, we're going to take a look at Orthworm's uh, stats real quick. Okay. We should be able... Okay. This should... Yep. Okay. I'm sorry, S yes, man, but like like I said, nobody dies from this. This is the last fight. No matter what, everybody everybody stays. Everybody stays. Okay. So Gudra. Gudra, 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 Gudra. Yeah, we need to get the fuck out of here. I didn't murder you. The other Pokemon did. Fucking... P 
Bahamut did in retaliation. Ooh. Oh my god, what? Holy shit. She predicted that. That's some old bullshit, man. Oh no. <laughs> Come on, man. Oh, wait. Yes! That's it. Okay, she has two more Pokemon. Okay, we keep keep this going. Okay. Switch out for Chungus. Cause I think I know what uh, that Dunsparce is gonna go for. I think. Oof. Yeah. Okay. Chungus. Save the run. Uh-oh. Oh, Chungus is a beefy fucking boy. He said he ain't going down without a fight. He ain't going down like a bitch. Yeah, Liquidation's just his strongest move, so we might as well just keep doing it. Ooh, okay. There we go. All right. Ooh. Nope. 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 All right. So we've healed once. So this is number two. Out of yep. Out of six. Ooh, and we go first this time, thanks to the Quick Claw. Alright, there's only one Pokemon left. And it's Mouscarada. Down to your last fucking Pokemon, huh? Oh, this is going to be... Oh. There's no way that this ends well. I don't think that there is a way that this can end well. Yeah, I don't think we live this. There's no way we can. Yeah. Chungus is a chunky fucking boy, but that is a situation we just cannot avoid. No matter what we do, or how hard we try. But now it's time to unleash a force that we've been waiting to unleash. It's time for vengeance to take the field. Because here's the secret of, uh, oh man, we terrestrialized already. So we just have to go for it. Oh, okay. Okay. Yes! Oh my god, vengeance has been served cold. Oh.
I feel the same. I feel the same. Either Vengeance was going to pull that out, or we were pretty much dead. All right. We did it. Yeah, this this game needs voice acting. But we fucking did it. Through so many sacrifices. A little, a, probably a little over two parties worth of sacrifice. But we made it to the finish line. And we actually crossed it. And we crossed it with the prodigal son, Vengeance, as well. And Victory Road is complete. And this is... This is it. This is it. I intend to finish the rest of the game um, on my own time. Um, I may stream uh, the remainder of um, the game on another day. But as far as um, Nuzlocke stuff is concerned, um, we are... we're done. I may actually uh, go back and catch a couple of um, familiar teammates to round about our, uh, round about our team. Um, there's, a uh, there's a few that I really liked and that I would really like to, um, have some time with because the thing is, is that between now and the amount of stuff that I could do all the way till this, till the, um, the road home and then the post game after that is enough time, I think, to legit, you know, I mean, I know it's a game and everything like that, but you want to bond, like, with the Pokemon that you choose and everything like that. You want to spend some time with them. Like, I, I don't think a lot of people, like, except for maybe competitive people, want to, you know, just have Pokemon at the level that they need them in. So I'll probably work on that a little bit. I'm going to bring back um, some, uh, some teammates that I really like. Uh, Broly's probably one of them. I want, I would love to see uh, Palma make a return. But then again, uh, Burb is, um, Burb, the Burb was a fucking champion and a half. Like, Burb put in the work. Like, I'll recommend anybody um, try out Burb at this point. But, um, but yeah, um, if, uh, Zach and uh, S fan, if you guys want to, um, if you guys just want to chill here um, for just a minute, I'm just gonna um, switch the stream off real quick, um, put it up for uh, World of Warcraft. <laughs> hey man, the burb's good. It's a simple burb, but it's a good burb. Like that's the thing. Like the only thing is, is that like I may uh, try to breed um, a like another one because um i would like to do a rain uh, a rain dance setup so that um i get the additional uh benefit of a 100 percent accurate uh thunder for one and then um a water-based attack in uh weather ball so i'm uh probably gonna do that at some point so i may actually retire uh the burb after all for now and maybe at some point in the future, you guys will see me do a playthrough where I start off with my preferred version of the burb. But um, for right now, I'm just going to um, save and I'm going to um, switch over the stream to get ready for uh, for World of Warcraft. Make sure all the info is right and everything like that. For anybody who um, is in the VOD gang that's watched, um, definitely appreciate it. 
I know that there were some shenanigans in the run and everything like that, but we did not um, dismiss the um, we did not dismiss the rule of death, and we only janked around with the rule of encounter a couple of times. Yeah, that, that's fine. That's fine. You go use the bandage room. I don't want you to do the pee, the pee shuffle or the or the um, poop crowning um, like that. I don't want you to be doing that. Um, but yeah, um, this was fun. I'll probably, um, if I'm going to do another Nuzlocke, either I'm going to do the concept of a Valhalla lock, which will be fallen uh, Pokemon. Um, we get all of them at once, but we can only use those. Um, or we'll just do a Terra Lock to where any fucking thing can show up with any kind of Terra type. Like, that sounds pretty fun to me. But it's going to be it for me for Pokemon for maybe a day or two until I figure out what I want to actually stream next, like for Pokemon. But, uh, but yeah, um, uh, I'm setting up for World of Warcraft. Anybody who's, um, in the chat, just, uh, chill out for a minute.